Now to a disturbing case of animal abuse. In fact, the Michigan Humane Society calls it one of the worst they've ever seen. A Hamtramck man admits to cutting off one of the legs of his eight year old dog. Tonight he is telling 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig why he did it. I didn't know what to do. I was at a loss and I, uh, I, I kind of did the procedure myself. Charles Wolford admitting to the unthinkable using a kitchen knife and gardening shears to cut off one of his dog's legs. It wasn't in no pain at all and then I just took some shears. With and, all due respect, how yes, can you say he wasn't in any pain? Because I was there with him. You know, I was very attached to my dog and that's something that I did then that I probably should not have done. Wolford claims his dog Blackie ran away and when he found him he was injured. Eventually gangrene set in and he didn't have the money to pay a veterinarian to treat him. But I couldn't afford the 800 so I, I did the best I could on my own. I, I, uh, what I did was I used toothache medicine you know, for your gums, for teething. I put that around there. I. Um, was it like I said, I was able to cut around the bone as cleanly as possible, and then I eventually was able to take the leg off. Thankfully, someone alerted the Michigan Humane Society's cruelty investigators yesterday. They responded and took the eight-year-old lab for emergency medical care. This is unimaginable torture. This is horrific cruelty um, uh, upon this, this dog. Blackie underwent surgery today and the Michigan Humane Society says if your pet needs medical care, reach out to them or other animal welfare organizations for help because what Wolford did can never be acceptable. It's too early for us to say he's out of the woods. I think his prognosis is good. Now that he's in our care, he's got a great chance of survival. A warrant request is now at the prosecutor's office for possible charges against Wolford. I don't recommend anybody to do it. I shouldn't have, never, I shouldn't have done it. And when did you do it? Uh, about four days ago. I don't want to go to jail. Uh, I, I would just would um, ask the public to forgive me for what I've done and uh, try and understand that I, I love my dog and I did it. Uh, I was trying to do it in the best welfare of my animal. In Hamtramck, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Oh, such a